The legendary captain himself. Stop it. You're making me blush. After all those years, I get to see you again. I have to admit, I'm surprised you even remembered me. You were pretty young back then. Sure I was, but I have a good memory. I remember everything. And I remember you saving those children. I always saw you as a hero after that day. Hero? <laughs> You're talking to a villain, my dear. The hero inside of me died many, many years ago when I was young. Isn't every villain a hero in their own story? Not in this one. If you say so. Back in Alaska, after the factory, what happened? Me and my father got out of the factory. We were running away. The explosions were everywhere. The whole place caught fire. My father was carrying me. He was struggling to get us out of there. And we managed to get out, but after that we weren't so lucky. We were walking in the middle of nowhere for days. I could feel my father was afraid and hopeless. The moment we thought we were going to die, help arrived. And that's where it gets all blurry in my mind, the help. It didn't really look like any combine. There was just a man. A man in a suit. A man in a suit? A man in a suit. In a suit? Yes, a man. In a suit. In a suit? In a suit. Sasha, are you sure that wasn't your father? He was also wearing a suit that day. No, no, it wasn't him. I'm sure it was someone else. A man with a briefcase. What did the man say, Sasha? What did he say? Black Mesa. Sasha! I think I remember- What the fuck? I have a bad feeling about this. Mitchell. Hey, Mitch. One shot, one kill. Mitchell. I'm back. Good to see you, Mitch. It's fucking hell out there. You gotta be kidding me.